Hi, Jeff Simon here at Sun and Fun 2023 with Social Flight. I'm here with Shane Woodson of UAvionics. How are you doing, Shane? I'm great. Thank you very much. Glad to be here. Listen, I'm a huge fan of UAvionics products. Obviously, you support Social Flight. We love that. Um, but we're using your products all through our Titan T51D Mustang, right? The AV30, the AV20. We absolutely love those. Going to be also using, you've got the AV Mag and AV Link. That's correct. Um, but I want to talk about something that you've got some news on right now. You Absolutely. are known for this unit right here. Sky right? Beacon, that is, that's where it all started in the ADSP world for the us. Sky Beacon, and so we're all used to seeing your products with a red light, and now- We've changed Now colors. we've got a green light, <laughs> but it's a lot right. more than that. So it tell is. me about this. Yeah, so Sky Sensor is, has been in the experimental world all the way up until this point. And we're proud to announce that we are taking it full TSO. So it'll be a TSO navigation light and a collision light and added safety awareness benefits of the ADSB receiver. And then you also get a GPS in there as well as you'll have a, um, a static port for pressure altitude. So your EFBs can actually report pressure altitude to pressure altitude instead of comparing yeah. relative altitude to GPS. I mean, so. it makes so much sense. It, it, it gives uniformity to the aircraft. You're already doing ADS-B out and to have a permanently mounted ADS-B in solution Absolutely. that gives all this access to anyone on board that's right. with their portables, with whatever. I mean, that, that's, that's pretty important. It is, and it's open GDL 90, so it works with all of the EFBs out there that support it. Wow, um, so I mean, I, I love that. Like I said, it, it, it looks right, it works right, it makes sense. What's the price? It is 750. So 750 is 750 for certified or experimental. And we're taking pre-orders for the certified now. I mean, that's not much more than just a portable. You've got a Velcro to your that's top right. of your panel and deal with batteries or have wires, you know, powering right. it from a cigarette lighter plug. Always that's, on, never runs out of battery. I like that. I like that a lot. That's great. <laughs> Plus, you don't have to worry about replacing bulbs in your wingtips and things like that. That's right. And like I say, you get the benefit of those LED strobes and LED nav lights, which are brighter and more energy efficient. Yeah, and I love that all the products are very, very integrated. So for us, again, we've got AV30, AV20. Um, we're doing install the Bonanza, we've got it in the Mustang, and it, it all like is one kind of cohesive family. And by having AV Link now, you have, well, why don't you tell me, what does well, AV Link do well, for it all? Exactly what you talked about, kind of connecting everything is AV Link is your Wi-Fi that's on the back of the AV30. So now Sky Sensor can actually report your traffic on the screen of AV30. Wow. So uh, it's yeah. uh, it's kind of connecting all those pieces in the panel. Okay. And I don't want to leave anything else out because at the top of the panel here, you have the Tail Beacon X. Yes. Now that's totally revolutionary because now you're talking about 1090 diversity, um, the ability to fly in Canada. All it's these a full mode things. S transponder with 1090 ES and, and it's space-based and terrestrial-based ADS-B compatible. So that is really truly your global transponder that is as future-proof as we can talk about. Wow, and, and I will say, I know uh, we've discussed this a little bit before. I've had a lot of people come to me and say, well, what if the aircraft doesn't actually have a, 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 a you know a tail light, which is part of your STC, but the, I think things have been done in the field where people can go and put stuff like in wing tips. As long as the orientation is that the, this antenna is up, the other antenna is down, even if it's sideways but enclosed in a wingtip, a lot of uh, mechanics have been able to just say, this is the STC, here's my field modification, and that gets approved. Yeah, that we've seen them put into, in the experimental market, we've seen them put into the wingtips and even certified inside the tube and fabric of a fuselage. Um, it, like I say, it comes back to the uh, the installer and the mechanic doing that that minor change or alteration to put it in there. That's awesome. And the last thing I just want to point out is UAvionics has a whole bunch of training videos that are available right now for free on Social Flight. Just go to socialflight.com or the free Social Flight mobile app for Apple and Android devices. And you have installation training available there. Not only is the training available, but it's FAA approved training. That That's means right. that you get a certificate at the end of that. If you are an AMP and you're part of the AMT awards program, then it goes automatically to the FAA system to give you credit. 
if you're an AMP and IA, you get a certificate that gives you that legal credit for education you use to your, towards your IA renewal. So lots of education and some great products. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Well, thank you. And we're so proud and, and, and thankful for what Social Flight has done with those training videos. It's, uh, it's, it's awesome to partner with you guys on it. Well, we're trying to make free training available to help improve safety all across the board. And anything we can do to work with great companies like UAV Onyx is just, just, just icing on the cake. It's wonderful. That's awesome. We all right. Thank you it. so much. Thank you so much. All right. For Sun and Fun 2023, I'm Jeff Simon. Blue skies.